everybody it feels so weird to be vlogging I have so much to fill you guys in on basically I've been cameraless for literally a month I was out for my birthday at the beginning of October and I dropped my vlogging camera when I was vlogging my birthday so a I couldn't vlog my ca uh, vlog my birthday and b that meant having to look for a new camera I bought one about two weeks ago it kept messing up and now I'm talking to you on my brand new Canon G7X which is like the YouTube camera everyone and their mum has this camera but I fell in love I didn't want to be too generic but then I just tried it out and I was like you know what there's a reason why everyone has it so I'm super excited about that and my plan for today is I'm going out to meet my friend I am actually running extremely late to go and meet one of my friends um, I think I was supposed to meet her like 10 minutes ago then I'm meeting up with more friends to go to a fireworks display tonight which is always a good excuse to be like a really big kid and then tomorrow I'm going to a spa with a brand and um, it just looks like the most beautiful spa and then I'm staying there overnight so I think I'm going to compile today tomorrow and then the next day into one vlog so I hope you enjoy it and I'm literally gonna shoot out the door now doing a really quick stroll I'm actually 40 minutes late so I bought her some candy kitten sweets to try and make up for it <sighs> we thought it'd be a good idea to have a photo taken in the urban outfitters photo booth literally haven't done this in such a long time here goes <laughs> should we play the video yeah is it a touch screen I'll play the video. I'm a bit means you have to actually go. Oh. So we've come along to Wagon Mamas and typical Naomi fashion. I've got the kids menu. They're actually like really big portions as you will see. And I'm going for the mini chat and the yasai one. It's like my favorite thing ever. So something from the kids menu. I think this bowl is huge and I just put the chili flakes on with any in here. It's got little bits of tofu in it as well. So I had a bit of a mix up with the days that I was supposed to be going to the spa. I'm actually going tomorrow. It's Tuesday now. I was supposed to be going on Sunday or so I thought, but it's actually tomorrow. I just got completely mixed up. But today I'm on Oxford Street just having a look around. I'm hoping there's loads of like Christmas decorations. I'm so excited to see because I haven't actually been to Oxford Street since they've like decorated it all up for Christmas. And I'm in like my super cozy furry jacket that I'm just wearing to death all the time and then I have a thick cardigan underneath as well so I am toasty we found the H&M home they have a little pop-up on Oxford Street and they literally have all of the Christmas stuff in oh they're really cute Yay. I love how Christmassy this little area is. Imagine putting the fire on. We actually have a fire like this at home and just sitting in front of it and having a hot chocolate. Oh, it's making me so excited for Christmas. They've also got a ton of like baubles in. I'm actually gonna do like a vlog of me going shopping for all my Christmas stuff. So I'm not gonna get anything now, but I'm definitely keep these in mind. I love this one. And I actually really like these pom-poms as well. The Christmas tree I have at home is white. So these would look adorable on them. It doesn't say how much they are. You could easily just kind of DIY these yourself though. Lola's have a new vegan cupcake. It's this red, red velvet. velvet. I don't actually like the look of that one. My favorite is, I think it, well, it's the passion fruit one. They That's don't have any. One. Oh, that one. It's got one left. It is the best thing in the whole entire world. It's got dark so quick, but I'm actually so happy with like the quality of this camera. It's amazing. Um, anyway, Holly is in Whole Foods Market and I'm just waiting outside. We're gonna go get some food. I think it's like five o'clock and it's 
pitch black already. I was literally just about to vlog saying how lucky we've been that it's not raining and it started to rain. Great. Taking ages as usual. <laughs> Bought loads of stuff for my blog, but I couldn't find what I wanted, but I did buy these. They're little rosemary. Are they for me? I think they're for me. Oh. They're rosemary um, flatbreads. So, and oh, I you've bought... got some cream. I had, cream. I had to do that Christmas. I bought you a pack of these. You know, the baby Oh, ones. super moons. Yeah. These are baby. These are basically for babies, then... but I really like them. They're like... Oh, they're salt and vinegar flavor. Yeah. Nice. So, and then I, and bought... I just love the packaging of those. For my dinner, quinoa, falafel, they're and hummus. And then two boxes of the... Um, boxes of the guac that we like. Very nice. So it turns out Oxford Street is absolutely mental tonight because they're turning the Christmas lights on which is really exciting but it's kind of like setting my anxiety off a bit because it's so incredibly busy. You will see like just where we're walking to they've blocked the road and it's a sea of people. Matt Terry is here uh, from the X Factor last year. I don't know who else um, but I'm going to see if I can see any people. As you can see, the whole of it's blocked off and it's ridiculous. Look at the sea of people. <laughs> I think they're doing the countdown now. We've popped ourselves on a side street and Rita Ora is turning the lights on. We are absolutely nowhere near where she is. She's near the BBC. And I'm just literally, as you can see, there's no one around here, whereas everyone is over there. <laughs> acquired a full box of the new Lola's cupcake the red velvet vegan ones yes the icing is pretty much domed on top and I think they have chocolate sauce inside I mean Lola's always seem to have some sort of sauce inside they look amazing I will give you guys a verdict later it's definitely cozy hat time we didn't actually get to see anyone um, that turned on the Christmas lights and um, but we've come back to the car because we have those Lola's cupcakes to drop off and now we're gonna find somewhere to eat I'm actually really gutted guys um, the event that I was supposed to go to the spa one that I keep talking about it's been cancelled literally the day before so I'm really really gutted about that um, I bought a new swimsuit and everything um, but hopefully there will be other other events to go to soon that means I have a whole two days to try and figure out something to do I'm probably just gonna end up filming <laughs> we're in a car park under Oxford Street at the moment and Oxford Street is literally ram-packed for the people so we will be very lucky if we can find I keep playing with my bubble <laughs> and we will be very lucky if we can find anywhere to go this is why I park my Ferrari see you later <laughs> following her she's got like a umbrella shield no don't run away <laughs> just gonna cut inside this Lola's cupcake and see if there's any chocolate inside oh and um, there's a little bit hold on look oh so you can see is that cake then that is that icing or okay. cake? it's quite thick yeah so there's like icing chocolate cake and it's red velvet and mm. it's vegan yum look beanie red velvet cake i'm obviously not going to give him that he doesn't want it anyway how can you not want cake oh my goodness you guys when i got home i had a package waiting for me and i opened it and it's my freaking play button i literally am lost for words okay let me show you i opened it when i was downstairs but i'm just i can't even you get this letter um, so it's basically just saying, you've done something special that very few YouTube creators accomplished. You had a, an astonishing 100,000 people subscribe to your channel. I'm literally so excited. I feel like I'm going to cry. And then it's my play button. I am just the most thankful person in the whole entire world. This has been my goal from day one. I never, ever, ever thought I would get 100,000. And to some people... This is nothing, and to others, this is everything to me. It literally means the world. I mean, it's amazing to have one person subscribe to your channel, to have a 100,000 people. It's just like, 
I just, I can't even explain. Just thank you literally every single one of you guys that has subscribed to my channel. And now I need to find a place for it to go. I mean, it kind of fits in with the decor in my room. I'm just literally gonna treasure this forever, thank you. It's like down to you guys that I have got this and I'm so thankful. And on that note, I am very tired, so I'm going to pop this away, find a place for it very soon, and say I will see you guys in my next vlog. Bye everyone.